This whole YouTube thing has to be the most funnest thing I've ever done. Like, honestly, like, this is really fun. Why? But this is, I know the whole thing's going on right now and everybody's kind of freaking out. But honestly, this is the best time that I've been, I've been having, I've been, I've been having so much fun posting. I love this stuff. Subscribe, all that stuff. It sounds so cliche and it sounds so weird that I'm saying it because I always see people. It does though, like for real, it does sound like cliche. <laughs> and it's funny how I just finished talking about, like me kind of making fun of people who wear masks. And here I am going to the grocery store, wearing a mask. Super doctory right now, but it's gonna be nice. It's gonna be fun. Ah oh, man, this guy took this guy took my spot. See the, the the sucky thing about doing vlogs is you're constantly going to compare them to the one before. Like obviously the first one was good. Like it was great because it was the first one. A lot of people tuned in because they were like, whoa, this is the first one? It looks so cool. Like it has all these cuts and stuff, and the sound is amazing. And then I just did this one, and this one was all right. It was cool, but it didn't really like motivate me. And that's the sucky thing about this whole thing, like happening. It was like, yeah, you get to stay home, but the sucky thing is that you get to stay home. Like you can't leave. Like I would love to go out right now. I'd love to go outside and film my friends and just film me going to places and going to things and trying new things out and showing all of you stuff. It's not gonna be like that for a little while. Should I do this? I do it already, so I don't know. I'll just do this. I won't tie it all the way. Hand sanitizer. Now, do I look funny? Of course I do. I feel funny. I feel stupid. But this is the way we are right now. A lot of people don't take these precautions like that. Some people do. Just like that, we back in here. Ain't gonna get me, motherfucker. This virus ain't gonna get me. It's so crazy because when you're in quarantine for so long, you, you start thinking that the air outside is like bad. It just feels like you're not supposed to be outside. So I guess that's why you feel kind of weird about it. Even going outside and being outside, even going to do this thing right here. It just, it does feel like I'm doing something wrong, but I'm not. It just feels like it. Hey guys, just so you know, if you guys see me wearing the same shirt, um, it doesn't mean that I've been wearing the same shirt for weeks on end. It just means that uh, around the time when I did have the shirt on, I was just filming a lot that day and I was having a very productive uh, filming day. So it doesn't mean that I'm wearing the same shirt. Just so you know. Sometimes I film this and it doesn't really fit the first episode or the second episode. So I just leave it. And then later on I'm like, oh, it's pretty good. I'll just leave it. So that's the reason why. I have the same shirt in some of the clips. Nostalgia week continues. So uh, this little sequence that I'm about to show you guys, it's it was from I think a year ago or almost two years ago. I filmed myself, and it was a it was it was a scenario that I was like, okay, this is pretty interesting. So pretty much, Bonnie Blue she invited me out to Las Vegas, and she wanted to film a music video. So. 
uh, I did just that. She uh, flew me out there, and I then I had less than 20. I think I had less than 24 hours in Las Vegas. But I was in Las Vegas for less than 24 hours, and I thought that was super interesting. So I filmed the whole process, and I had uh, the GoPro that I had back then, and I had it uh, strapped on my head for most of the time. So here is the 24 hours in Las Vegas.